I'm Zona Roman from the Surfcasters Journal. We're in Mexico with Ryan Wudge from Advanced Fishing. He uh, imports Century Rod. He's one of the main designers. Uh, uh, on for this particular trip, we caught uh, a lot of uh, toros. We didn't get into rooster fish good this year, but he made these rods, which are fascinating. I've been fishing with them now for a week, just about every day. The nine footer and a twelve foot six, 12 foot six yeah, right, 12 which foot is a beast. We'll go into it in a second. The nine footer is really light rod. It's same component, so we're just going to cover the twelve one, uh, which is great anywhere from half an ounce all the way up to up to four ounces. Yeah, really. I mean it's one of the lightest. What what is the what is this made of? I mean, it's uh, very it's a, light. It's aerospace grade carbon fiber. Um, it also incorporates our anti-twist technology, which uh, keeps the rod straight under a torsional load. Um, and we did do the uh, recoil um, guides, guides, which, yeah, which yeah. yeah, I want you to show to our viewers. I mean, these guys have fished for, for the first time. These are just um, guides that yeah. don't break. So yeah, they, basically the beauty of it is to be on a trip and not worried about cracking your guide. Yep, you got it. Um, we've uh, we built several rods for guys like this, uh, actually fishing in the rocks in the Northeast also uh, works great. Anytime when you're gonna be in a situation where you're afraid of knocking the rings out of your guides or someplace like this where we're remote, and uh, you might have a problem with a, with a regular guide, this solves your problem. You don't have to worry about snapping them off. I think it's a great out. thing, not only that, but we've been running for a week with a lure attached to these things on the quads, and the lures are banging. I mean, yeah. if we had a guide, we probably wouldn't have the inserts <laughs> or the guides any longer. Uh, the other thing is, I mean, this, this is a beast. Yes. This is a beast. I, I am not a great caster, but I have never casted further in my life than on this trip. This is a five-piece rod. Just explain to the, the, the uh, viewers not only the rod itself, but the components and the carrying case. Okay, so this guy right here, this is also uh, an aerospace grade carbon fiber. Um, just like all of our rods, it is autoclave processed. This one we have left uh, unsanded. So this adds an extra element of durability to the rod. Also, you know, just a little bit more material. All rods come out looking like this and then they sand them off. So as you can see, there's a little wear on the bottom here from yes. the uh, from the rod racks. Uh, nothing to worry about. It's not not a problem. Doesn't affect the rod structurally anyway. Um, we did a Fuji reel seat on here. This is the DPSM reel seat, or uh, sorry, DNPSM reel seat, which is their ergonomic reel seat. So uh, it's. It's really nice. It, it fits in your hand very well when you're fishing. It's very comfortable. I mean, yeah. considering this heat, and I'm, we're both sweating right now in 100 yeah. degree heat. I did, <laughs> you know, I never felt that this rod tied me out all day long, yeah. which was which was awesome. Yeah, we also did a locking nut on this also, so it doesn't uh, doesn't come undone on you. And this is based on what model? This is based on the Slingshot 1505. Okay. Which has been a, a super popular long range uh, long range rod for us for a long time. Uh, a real go to for Mexico. This just makes it easier for it to get here. And now this is five piece. Yes, right. Five Twelve pieces. foot six. It casts about a, a hundred and fifty two hundred. <laughs> I've watched you cast, and man, oh man, I mean, geez. But so it, it fits in this case. And and here's the story. Uh, when I met him at Dallas, he had two of these, right? With a nine footer broken down. He also had a six footer that he had for jigging, and this one all in the case. And and a, a, a compartment here for reels where you just walk into the plane and don't pay $150 for a bazooka tube. The whole thing fits in neatly. I mean, this is this is really a good idea. Yeah, yeah. It was. Uh, it's something I've been working on for a while. Um, we decided to bring it to fruition last year, and um, it's uh, it's been super popular. The guys that have them really like it. Um, the the thing you do have to watch is as it is a five piece rod, it's got a lot of ferrules in it. Right, and you know, especially if you're power casting, you know, having all the ferro, all everything moving around, you just got to check your ferrules every so often. You know, every, every 25, 50 casts, something like that. Make sure you go through and just tighten your ferrules up, and uh, it's it works perfect. The other thing is, you know, I caught fish around the world. I haven't been to a million places, but I've been to some places, and no fish ever kicked my ass like the, the, the like Jack <laughs> does. But we we do have some pictures and some videos. Yeah, yeah, show. we do. And I mean the raw the way. The rod looks, it doesn't look like it has any ferrules. And my no. point is, I'm not trying to make it something that it's not, yeah, but it is a really powerful rod. It and is and very powerful. When those waves smooth. go up about 12 feet and will look like they're gonna kill you, and you got a big, big jack on, and this rod really held its own. I, I mean, 
I know that the twisting a little bit on five piece rods, you're gonna have to adjust every 20 casts or so, but I mean, I'm, I'm really impressed and you know, and, and it's a really, really good product. How do people contact you uh, regarding making this? I mean, if we, um, we, we do it, we, this is uh, this is our what we were considering our factory build for the travel rod. Um, you can also get it with Alkanite guides or right. something like that if you don't want to spring for the titaniums, but you can uh, you can get a hold of us at, uh, at Advanced Fishing. And uh, that is www.advancedfishing-usa.com. And uh, you can also call us at the shop. And that is telephone number 252-987-2428. We're there every day. Um, don't hesitate to call. We'd be happy to talk to you. Now, this you made with the, you put the guide, you actually put a guide yeah, on the Yeah, we put an actual guide on the tip. This is gonna replace, be replaced by a uh, titanium steel uh, guide. Yeah, but even this, I mean, if you're gonna go on a trip, you're gonna bring a spare tip. You're not gonna bring uh, uh, guides to wrap, probably just gonna be like me and skip a guy to keep pushing. <laughs> but you bring some extra tips and a little lighter, and in five yeah. minutes, you're back in business. Yeah. So this guide yeah. is not as important as the rest of them, yeah. which make this life easier. Well, thank you very much, and best well, of luck. Yeah, and, uh, man, thanks, thanks for, for fishing, dude. Oh, man, I had a great time. Thank you. See you later. Bye.